howdy, hey everyone. Good morning, welcome from Epcot. We're back, it is now Festival of the Holidays. This is the day after Thanksgiving, uh, November 25th to be exact. This is the first day of Festival of the Holidays here at Epcot. I am so excited. We got a Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind boarding group and because of it uh, is Festival of the Holidays, um, Cosmic Rewind has a new holiday remix. So I'm super excited to see what that's about. I can't wait. We're gonna try some food. Here's the fountain right behind me. Let's go do it. We're at Epcot. And coming in this morning was absolutely crazy. As you can see, the line to get into the park is just crazy. It shows you really how many people are visiting um, and then compared to like the annual pass order line. Wow. So first up on our journey, we're heading towards Figment because I think it's a, a low-ish wait, maybe five to 10 minutes. Uh, Spaceship Earth back there was crazy. Said it was a 55 minute wait. Never do that when you when you come to Epcot first. Always hit it later on in the day. <sighs> and the Living Seas right here, 25 minutes. They're on the extended queue outside. But we are heading straight ahead. I don't know if I can see anybody outside just yet for the Figment queue. So Figment's line, it says 20, but man oh man, it's outside in the extended queue. I think we're gonna just go, oh wow, of course. I think we just missed the show. Pixar short film is also 20. Oh boy, we'll see, we'll see what happens. So instead of waiting for the Pixar short film festival or Figment, we are over here by the jumping water. And it is, I love just watching the jumping water. Um, but I'm also just checking out the festival passport and I know the holiday cookie strolls back. We have Olaf's holiday tradition expedition. Um, we have, you know, some holiday overlays for attractions, living with the land and the guardians of the galaxy cosmic rewind. And as well as entertainment, we have, uh, you can meet Santa Claus in the Odyssey building. There are a few storytellers in each of the uh, countries around around the world showcase, which is awesome. Um, and it basically tells how children around the world in that specific country celebrate the holiday season. And then one of my favorite things is the candlelight processional, which is basically uh, the cast choir. So all cast members um, are in the choir uh, and they have three shows, one at 515, one at 7, and one at 830, uh, back in the American Pavilion. So that's always a good one. We'll definitely make our way over there. Maybe not today, um, but it looks like today um, is, oh, Shang-Chi himself. He's gonna be the, a narrator. I love that. Oh, look who it is. It's Pooh Bear, and look, he has a Santa hat on. He's so cute. Hey! <laughs> so it's not open quite yet, but here at Chestnuts and Good Cheer Holiday Kitchen, here's where you can get cinnamon glazed almonds, cinnamon glazed cashews, pecans, fire roasted chestnuts. Wow. And hot cocoa and eggnog. I love it. We'll be back. Donut box here for Festival of the Holidays. Definitely I'm gonna try the croissant donut later on today, hopefully. Man, look at that. Oh, the donut box. Is that gonna be like a, a sampling of all of them? Ooh. All right, so while we were gonna be waiting for our boarding group to be called, we got the Olaf's Holiday Tradition Expedition. So we're gonna be starting, uh, it's a little scavenger hunt around the world showcase. We're starting in Mexico. So as we're starting in Mexico, there is a line right here to get into the Mexico Pavilion, right here, like inside the, the little pyramid here. Wow. Sheesh is busy. And I am gonna spoil where everything is in this video for the Olaf's uh, little scavenger hunt. So there's the first one right over the, here in Mexico. And here is the storyteller stage in, in Norway. So maybe we'll have to come back a little bit later on or hopefully we uh, see one of the storytellers in another country. And here is Olaf at the, on the top of the roof over here. What does he have? Is that a little reindeer? Oh yeah. 
Up next, the China Pavilion. Probably gotta go in and just search for Olaf. Let's see. I don't see any snowmen over here just yet. And here's Olaf. Oh my goodness, there he is. He's right across from the Lotus Blossom Cafe. And here is this right here. This is actually open right now. It's only uh, 10.52, so open early. This one looks really good. The cheese fondue and a bread bowl. Ooh. Also, Epcot's doing the holiday cookie stroll again. If you get five stamps of, uh, you get five cookies, you get a completer cookie, uh, which is really awesome. So, since we're gonna be here a couple times, I could get one cookie each time I come, or I could get all five right now, um, and then I would get a completer cookie, which is awesome. So right back here, here's Olaf in the Germany Pavilion with some candy canes. Where are you, Mr. Snowman? I wanna find you now. My theory is they might put them inside the pavilion, but not so far inside where you're like all the way at the back. So I feel like they would be more closer to the front. Let's see. They might be by the gelato stand right around the corner here. He is. And there he is, Mr. Snowman. Right by the gelato stand. So for Olaf's scavenger hunt, there's an Olaf in the American Gardens Theater, which is right over here, as well as the American Adventure, which is over there. So in America, you get two. So you gotta be on the lookout. So there's Olaf holding some candles right in front of the Christmas tree. So in the American Adventure Pavilion, we did end up stopping at the booth. We got the turkey with no cranberry sauce, just said. They can do that. Um, they asked if it was a, a, an allergy or a preference. I said preference. As well as we got the chocolate crinkle cookie and we uh, that was our first cookie on our little cookie stroll. So far the turkey dish, really, really amazing. Um, the turkey's really good, it's not too dry. The stuffing is really good. Uh, the mashed potatoes, so good. And the nice crunchy green beans. I'd say this is a 10 out of 10 for sure. And I'm not a huge fan of like turkey in general, but this is a 10 out of 10 for me. And the chocolate crinkle cookie, so far, it's really good. I've had two bites and I wanna go back for a third. So that's a good sign. I'd say it's a, an eight out of 10. It kinda tastes like a, like a Subway chocolate, chocolate cookie, if you've ever had one. I've said it, but I'm gonna say it once more. Both things in here, amazing. And now, the more that I eat that cookie, I changed my answer. It's now a 10 out of 10. That was so delicious. It was nice and soft. Wow, that was a great cookie. And you know what? We walked right past this one. He is holding sheet music right outside the America Gardens Theater. All the way to Japan with empty hand. Practicing with empty hand. It was cold. Kara, empty. Te, meaning hand. Yeah! Kara, te. And there he is. Also, I feel like my theory was incorrect because we are pretty much at the back of the Japan Pavilion. Alright, so here in the Japan booth, we have a, a sushi tree. That looks nice and festive. I like that. It looks really good. And you know what? Decided to go for it. It's Christmas and I've been talking about sushi for a long time. So sushi tree, here we come. All right, so here is the sushi tree. We're gonna give it a shot. I think it's crab meat in there. Ah, we'll see. All right, that sushi was actually pretty good. I give it probably a mm, seven and a half or eight out of 10. Uh, there was just something in there that I wasn't like a huge fan of, but like overall, it was good. It was good to eat sushi again. And 
way better than the last sushi I had from uh, the Japan booth. Uh, I think it was like food and wine in 2021. Oh my goodness, that was, that was bad. And here's Olaf in the Morocco Pavilion. Sort of close to the Morocco bathrooms with, I believe those are olives. All right, and there is Olaf over here. He's on top of this little, uh, little booth over here. And here he is over here in the little French garden. Oh my goodness, what is he holding there? Yule log. Look at that. All right, there's Olaf, and he's got gingerbread men. Oh, that guy stepped right in. There it is. And with that, we completed Olaf's holiday tradition expedition. So now we are heading to the creation shop to get our little prize. And here is our prize that we got for completing Olaf's uh, holiday expedition. So that's super cute. It's, all, it's like a little coin bag. I might use it as a ornament for the Christmas tree. So here is the croissant donut from the donut box. And we came over here. Uh, from the last time I saw you, we actually did end up manage uh, to go on Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind. I didn't film just because I wanted to enjoy the holiday version uh, in all its glory as best I can. And it was okay. I was almost pretty much expecting a little bit more. Um, I know it's not the same ride as Mission Breakout uh, in California Adventure, but Mission Breakout for Halloween, they do Monsters After Dark and they change the whole pre-show, they change the whole ride, and they do a really good job. This was just like the same pre-show, same everything, same like, I guess, audio track, but it was just Christmas music almost forced forced into there, if that makes any sense. So it was okay. I'm glad I did it though. Um, I'm definitely gonna go back again because I, I just love the coaster. It's such a fun coaster. So yeah, overall, that's my thoughts on the holiday remix. And that is gonna do it for our trip out to Epcot for Festival of the Holidays. We did Olaf's scavenger hunt around the World Showcase, which is a ton of fun. Uh, tried a few food items from a couple of the booths, which it was pretty good. I enjoyed it. Definitely excited to come back uh, to Epcot uh, as the festival is gonna continue on throughout December. So, excited, Spaceship Earth. We didn't get a chance to ride it today. We'll ride it next time. If you guys like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you not, have not already. There will be more videos like this one. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video.